It's day two of Michael Sam's life as a cowboy, and it felt a lot like a typical Thursday at Valley Ranch. The media turnout was back to the regulars. Sam's name never even came up in Jason Garrett's morning press conference. The focus is on the 49ers. The 49ers are as good a team as there is in the National Football League, so, you know, uh, our focus is on doing what we can do to prepare uh, to play our best football on Sunday. So Sam may be yesterday's news for the Cowboys, but not for everyone. A DC lobbyist named Jack Berkman is promising thousands of conservative Christians will protest signing Sam outside AT&T Stadium Sunday at the home opener. All for a guy who won't be wearing pads during the game. Well, the pads were on Thursday for practice squad duty. It pays about 6000 bucks a week. By the way, that's a quarter of the rookie minimum. They don't travel to road games and can get cut at any time. But for players like Michael Sam, it's a chance to be one step away from an NFL field. I'm trying to help the Cowboys any way I can uh, so I can earn a spot on this team and help our team uh, win games. And for people like the D.C. lobbyist, it's a chance to convince folks who something wrong with an NFL player being gay? Hey, the only thing that could go wrong on Sunday is losing. 